rush to start businesses in the United States declared for LP. Baba Sendek Badamose advises obedient. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. Please subscribe to our channel. Prominent Nigerian businessman, real estate developer and politician Baba Sendek Badamose has advised supporters of P2B and the Labour Party popularly referred to as obedient to start investing in the economy of any state declared for Labour Party. But I'm also disclosed that the reason people should start taking business advantage and positions of state under the Labour Party's government is because consumption is about to become production in the state. He said, rush and buy land to start business in any state declared for Labour Party because consumption is about to become production there. Let the architect and engineers design your roof optimally for sufficient solar power to drive your business. Plan for sufficient solar power from the onset no matter the cost. And thank me later. Apple did it. Tesla does it. You must do it. But Baba Tendek Baba, 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 post on Twitter with us. Dear obedience, investor tip. Rush and buy land to start business in any state declared for labor party because consumption is about to become produ production there. Let your architect and engineer design your roof optimally for sufficient solar power to drive your business. Plan for sufficient solar power from the onset, no matter the cost, and thank me later. Recall that just a while ago, Alex Oti of the Labour Party was declared winner of the Abia State gubernatorial election. It is easy to detect that by the most advising the to start investing in Abia State, as it is not have an economics piloting her. Well, to me, this investor tip, it makes sense well, though. Sincerely. But what I'm going to tell the, it was a call, what I'm going to tell them is, yes, no, no, no so it's supposed to be sure. Normally, had it been say we, 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 we get better economy for this country, tell me what will make us live this, this country where God don't bless nyafu, nyafu. Leave and go another place, go invest. Of course, it's, 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 you know, you know, you know, go well for year. Hmm? So this investor advice, obedience, how far? Uh, to me, in a better advice. Eh? And of course, I know, say, the risks are there. What if you do all those things and, you know, you still have to start funding and, you know, do... Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, yes, Alex Oti was um, declared the winner of the governor governorship election in Abia State. And of course, and I think what is also... Following this investor tip is um, the fact that Abia State is like the economic hub of the eastern region. Yes, we have not just Abia State. They have Abia, they have Onicha, but no. Aba, ha. Aba markets. Ah. <laughs> I'm not sure say get any way go find go there where you go see you. No jokes. I do mean there is equity among all the geopolitical zones in the region. The federal government treats them as one. I tell you, and they have been able to tap into or invest in the market. I kid you not. Who China be for where we did? Who China be? If you expand the economy past their own. No jokes. This thing I'm telling you is true. Nigeria is a land truly blessed with milk and honey. It's just that um, the milk and honey, just a few people have been milking it. And it is time we say enough. Let everybody benefit from this milk and honey that is being served, eh? Make the rice and stew go round. Um, despite all the whole, what's it called? The whole, should I say, um, wuru wuru? <laughs> should I say wuru wuru? What happened for presidential and gov uh, governorship election? I tell you, this election is, uh, this 2023 election is an election we are not going to forget. I don't think it will ever leave history, to be very sincere with you. From the presidential down to the governorship election, a lot of people stood in the line, even when you were being threatened. Sincerely, first of all, one heal us for this country. We did try. I say, make a heal us. If nobody heal you, I beg. Put your hand for your chest. Tell yourself, say, we did try. Put your hand for your chest. Tell yourself, say, you be man. If na man, you be. If na woman, you be. Tell yourself, you be woman. I beg, praise yourself. Celebrate yourself. It's not easy. Hmm? I say this because a lot of us faced a lot of difficulties during, before, you know, the election. First of all, to even get your PVC in a problem. You go queue for line for one week. Some say then queue for line for one month. Then after you did the whole PVC thing to collect Ampano, to collect it, problem. Eh? 
a meat problem. You will still go through the whole process of you go, you know. Many people who after even going there several times, their 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 PVC follow for the one will be say some people carry their own points I got her, I've been inside car now. You know, be, be even till the election eve, to the eve of the election, a lot of people PVC they, they were kept the I don't know if it was INEC that came out and said then C P V C O PVCs as in then carry people PVC, go through way. You understand? Now after all those things, some people still, you know, come outside. I heard that the, you, you know you can use your paper PVC to actually vote. Have you? Mm -hmm. There are some people who use their paper on to vote. So far, say they don't do the paper on. You know, they were able to pick. Uh -huh. and the presidential election came despite uh, what happened. Despite the plan of INEC the frustration. The fact that they came out late, the fact they did not come out to some materials, a lot of you know super story. The story just they go up, down, up, down. Eh? Even a lot of frustration for my neck. We still come outside. We still vote. Then I knew people who, no matter what happened in the presidential election, they come out and they say, you know what, this governorship, we must come outside, and they did. They came out at the expense of, let me say, at the cost of. They don't know what is going to happen. Even after the whole trade, so oh, if you do this one, yeah, we know there were people who paid the Supreme Prize during this election. Sincerely, my I'm sending my heartfelt condolences to people who lost people this election. I see me, I tell on I see. Now, for this reason, eh, we're not going to allow this flame that has been in, in kindled in us. We are not going to allow it to dry out. We are going to keep pushing for a better Nigeria. If you want, if you want. Uh, give up. Just remember, say, there are people who gave their lives so that we can actually continue the struggle. Because to me, I feel it is not over until it is over. And so it is too early to come out and start saying, uh, you know, we don't do one now. Because a lot of people will be like, ah, 2023 election, after everything I do, nothing work. But I tell you, the people who have paid the price, who have paid it forward, so that we will continue to push. Mm? And their joy would be to see that Nigeria becomes better for all of us. Those people, they were not asking for gold. They were not asking for silver. They were not asking for land. They were not asking for precious stones. What they were asking for was a better Nigeria where the middle class, the high class, the low class, we are all going to the economy go favor all of us. Mm? So this uh, investor tip where Mr. Badamosi gave us, say make we use um, hold body. Eh? Nigeria will be great again. Okay, on this note, you have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for telling me to listen. Until I come your way next time, enjoy the rest of your day.